Hello, El Paso, and welcome to Fact Friday. I'm Martin Padilla. We're here at El Paso Animal Services, where shortly, Michelle Anderson will be joining us to tell us all about National Foster Month and about fostering. Michelle, first off, thank you so much for joining us. For those that don't know, what is fostering? Fostering is providing a temporary loving home to a pet or pets in need here at the shelter. And our foster program is actually one of the most life-saving programs that we have here at El Paso Animal Services because it gives the pets a chance to get out of the shelter environment and into a loving home, which they deserve. Is there a cost to fostering? Fostering is actually completely free. We provide all the food, supplies, medical care that you would need to care for your foster pet or pets. You just provide the love and a temporary loving home for usually anywhere from about two to eight weeks. What kind of pets need foster? We have a wide variety of pets that need foster. Anything from uh, pets that are recovering from injury or illness and need you know, a soft place to rest and recover, or pets that are still too young to be adopted like kittens or puppies and they need to stay in foster for a few weeks until they are old enough to be adopted. And then we also have adult pets that just are way too stressed here in the shelter environment and they just need a temporary place to go, you know, be in a loving home on a stretched out on a couch and getting the, all the love and uh, care that they deserve. How can someone get started? We are actually hosting an SOS emergency foster event this Friday and Saturday, June 10th and 11th from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. where we will be matching families that are able to foster with pets that really need to get out into foster homes right now. Currently, the shelter is at critical capacity with over a thousand animals at the shelter right now and we really need to get at least 40 medium to large sized dogs out into foster homes as well as litters of kittens that you see behind me here because the shelter is no place to grow up and spend more than a couple of days here and we have so many pets that need to go out into loving foster homes so if you can help please come out and join us at uh, our events this weekend if you can't join us this weekend we are still able to match you with a foster pet seven days a week 11 a.m. to 6 p.m. Is there anything else you'd like to add? If you're going to be joining us for our event this weekend, you can go ahead and start that onboarding process on our website, elpasoanimalservices.org slash SOS Emergency Foster. Uh, go ahead and sign up, take our online orientation, our foster orientation, and then visit us for an upcoming event. It'll be truly an expedited process because we really need to get these pets out into loving homes, even if it's just for a couple of weeks or up to a month. So if you can help please if you never thought about fostering if you've always thought about fostering but never were ready to take the jump if you have a home that has just a little bit of extra space even if you think that you don't have the time or the energy to provide a foster home it's much better than that pet spending 24 7 here in a tiny kennel your home is going to provide so much more love and comfort to that pet rather than us here at the shelter so please now is the time to help. If you can't adopt or foster right now, you can also always donate or volunteer. Well, that does it on this edition of Fact Friday. Michelle, thank you so much for joining us and thank you all for watching. If you need any more information on fostering or anything related to the El Paso Animal Services, make sure and visit their social media pages or visit elpasoanimalservices.org. We'll see you all on the next Fact Friday.